please become a member by pressing the join button and choose super fan or ultra fan or just go into my channel and press the join button 89.5% uh, of watch my videos are not subscribed so please subscribe for like my content if you want to support me and pl please turn location and all when you're done there so so never go to miss in my future videos and also F in the description down below, check out the Mr. Fred Fest by Pizza Season 1, Episode 1, the beginning. And at 550 subscribers, the trailer, both, uh, trailers for both versions of Episode 2 will drop. And at 600 subscribers, the trailers for them will drop. Now, let's get into the video. Hey, welcome back to another video. And today, we're going to do a civil view of 71795. Temple of the Dragon in the Jacob. Don't know how many pieces there are, and it's an 18, pl uh, not 18, 8 plus set. So, what we're going to do if you're new here in set reviews, well, hey, and welcome. But first, we're starting for the box, then the instructions, then the leftover pieces, then let's look at the ma how many stickers there are, and then the minifigures, and then the set itself. Oh, wait, the side pillows, then first. So now, Let's get to it. This box looks really, really nice. Like this logo in the beginning, I thought it looked kind of goofy. I actually really like it now. And instead, I didn't like there was just a blank red background, but you can actually kind of see the details. You cannot see that on my camera, I can kind of see it. But because I don't know the text is so big, so you barely notice it. Then this is many other sets, Jack and Jack's Horizon, and the background looks so nice. I really like the forest feel, and then we can see obviously all of the, all of the ninjas. Look at the top, we can see the ninjas and cool. I think it should have been um, Spirit of the Temple, him because it's the only set he's in. So obviously. This side we have Nia, oh, there's a Nia, post of Nia, but, and also the next side. This side was just some of the leftovers in that one, because it's bigger set you could do this. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't, it doesn't really work, and it's really annoying. But the next set of reviews are going to be the new Nia Dragon Wave, so that's really cool. And Marvel. Uh, here's how it looks on the bottom. And then here's a picture of the bag. You can see some of the things you can do. You can collect the bones. Yeah, it looks really nice. I would give this a 10 out of 10. Probably my, one of my favorite backgrounds. I really like the background. So, yeah. Then let's go to the instructions. Okay, actually, when I really look at them, it actually doesn't look that bad. It looks really, really nice. Like they kind of blend in. But that's really nice. And look how thick this is. Back, the same thing I've got for years, the light one. And you can see it. The classic. Again, for some reason, they choose Kai to be the one that's down here. Still think it should be the Spear of the Temple. I forgot his name in the show. But yeah, like it's the classic how the age now. I actually kind of like it. I would get it an 8 out of 10. If it was the background, I would get it a 10 out of 10. Then. But here is the left of our pieces. And this was from one of the shurikens, this plastic piece you just you just throw out. But also, there was also that brick separator, but I don't know where I left it. But we also got this sticker sheet. So in total there is 11 different stickers, but plus some of them actually have extra some 12, 14, 15, 3 extras equals 15, no wait, 14 stickers in total. So yeah, now we really have your day. But let's get to the mini figures. What the hell? What is happening? Hi, how the heck did you fall? Oh, 
Okay, let's just start with the classics. Okay. Let's show my M. Let's start with Nia. But Dragon Strikes Nia or I don't know. I don't know. what did you call this suit? I actually have no idea. But this suit look I have um always oh, own this one. I don't know if it's supposed to be these hills. Is it gun middle grey? It looks really nice. I really like this color scheme. And here's the how it looks with this side of the head and then how it looks with this side of the head. Yeah, looks really nice. And yeah, I actually really like Nia's color scheme in this one. I really like if you didn't know my favorite color is blue. And here yeah, boom and boom. Yeah, really like this her new face. Inspection and yeah, the details really, really nice. Also, here's how it looks at the back again, looks really, really nice. I really like this one. And you just come with generic armor, I don't know, generic sword pieces, nothing new here. Then we go to Kai's version. And again, actually, I forgot how much I like this suit line. The suit line looks great, but it kind of annoying with like you just. You see, whatever. Well, um, also with this mask, it doesn't really fit. Seriously, it's just a few centimeters. I know, man, it's like, yo, <gasps> oh. oh, not even centimeters, millimeters. But again, this suit looks really nice with this gold printing and stuff. And here's how it looks with the other hips. Yeah, again, looks really, really nice. Um, let's take this monstrosity off. Oh. Again, this I just really this really fit Kai. Then the other smiling face, the, it did really not. But actually, this set is actually my last Ninja Turtles Prison season season one set, other than the four plus and the polybag one. Again, this look again really nice. Yeah, really like the printing and stuff. Yeah, I think this one also is pretty good. And then we got to the last Ninja. Yes, cool. Mm, yeah, I don't think I like him as much as me. Yeah, and Kai is still a really, really nice one. Yeah, we really like this one. You can see, I don't know, the, his earth energy through it. And yes, how is this? He looks angry, but he's actually not angry because he's actually smiling. Yeah, it really fits his smile. And here, yeah, how the other one look? Yeah, really nice detailing all around. Yeah, really like this one. Also, this two times is just so great. Still, really annoying. We have not seen. Oh, we have seen, but not a, as a ninja. Spoilers, but, uh, by the way. Yeah, will probably be spoilers. But then we go to the, the only mini figure I missed is. Um, Speaker of the Timber. Did he have a name in season one? I really don't remember. But again, he looks really, really good. And here, how it says other face print is not as, as good. But okay, you cannot even see it with the hood on. You cannot even see his face. It's really hard to see. I cannot see it, but he, trust me, he has a stone face. So yeah, but I still think this looks better. Again, I really like the skirt piece, you know, and yeah, you can really see the spears in here and the spears, and yeah, another one, another, another good minifigure. Then we go to Lord Rast, next season two, the main villain, probably, maybe, not really, I don't know. But again, he looks so good. I know some people complain why he doesn't have his arm prints, that's because he has sleeves on, I think, maybe. I don't know. Like again, you could just take this out and put it on the other one. But then again, he has this gold printing here, so kind of nice. The same is fine, but it, it is longer in the TV show. Like, the more than Couldn't even do the right size. But I really like this molded head. It looks great. I don't know why, but people say it looks more like a tiger. Uh, and some people say it looks more like a wolf. I think it looks like a lion. Or is it just me? Well, I really like the, the eye printing, like metallic thing. And here's the 
this armor piece that was new in this wave. Here is its torso print, looks really nice, it's really detailed and bad torso print. You also have his arm printing, again looks really really nice. Another really great minifigure, there's just nothing else but great minifigures in this wave. Just like crystallized, it's also just great minifigures. And then we got Empress Beatrix, I think it's how she's called, right? The guys. Yeah, Empress Beatrix. I think Beatrix sounds kind of better, but that's just in my opinion. This soul piece looks so good in this way. I said it when Lego would do more in Jack with this soul, but soul piece, but in other colors, that would look so, really, so, so cool. This hair piece is cool, but it doesn't really cover up her face, uh, her back face print. This is how you look in the short thing. And you see, you can see a little of her mouth other sided print head. That's really annoying. But you can see kind of gold metallic prints. And he has a back print. And let's take this armor piece off. And god dang it. Boom. There you go. Again, really, really detailed as always in these minifigures. And yeah, really nice back printing. So yeah, that, that's just minifigures. Now let's get into the cell, cell, ah, take play the side build itself <laughs> before we go to the main builds. And here's the side build. Nothing too crazy. Like this is really nice um, sticker. It looks really good. And these lanterns. Actually, this is printed. By the way, if this was a sticker, I would cry. But yeah, that looks really, really nice. And this is the, the weapon we get. I think it's from to the spirit. Let's just look how it would look. Um, yeah, he looks really good with this weapon. Okay, basically any weapon suits many of the minifigures, except the scuba weapons to the ninjas. That would look, that looks so weird when they have the normal suits on. Right here is, uh, and this set is massive. Like, look how massive this set is. Even compared to in Jefferson Markets, check out that video in the description down below. But let's start off here. See, we got this well, and see this kind of spirit thing, like like the spirit of the temple. You also got it like this. Uh, normally, it should look like this, but sometimes things move and it changes how it will look. Yeah, it's really good, like this. And these plants are everywhere. Oh, this tree kind of thing. But we also have a e um Mac armor from Evil uh, and a core core Evil Mac um you know that arm thing that came from twenty twenty two. Yeah, boom, it's there. Also got the yeah this is actually recorded in twenty twenty four. The versus the other set reviews, but we also got this tree thing. Nice, you can do this. Have a play feature. I can show you on the other side, but again, these this looks really nice. This door looks great. You can boom and go to another world. So yeah, here is one of these. These are also in the other in Java cities. I think Lego is of seven of these. We also got part of this tree. I will show the rest of it later. But again, it looks really nice. Now let's go to the back and where we enter the temple. Right here, nothing too crazy. We also got here some books and all the rest of these dragons, like we saw in the show. There's also a play feature here, but that's on later. But yeah, that's nothing more. Uh, here's how you can control the tree, like here. Boom. Now let's go to the next floor. Here is one of the rooms where the Temple of the Spirit lays. Rest in peace, I guess. Uh, boom. And then you can obviously activate him because that's the boom. And then you can flip on this. And then he jumps out. Actually, my first time I did it, he also jumped out. Of it. I don't get why he doesn't do that anymore, but okay. Again, we get a fun play feature. I think kids will have a lot of fun with that. 
Then we go to the place feature I told you about down here. You just take this out and boom, something drop in your head. You see how it looks up here. So now let's show you how it would be for minifigure when they were downstairs. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I hope there's some cake down here. Okay, that's a bad core inspection. Mm. There we go. Also, there's actually some detailing here. It's showing that uh, it's the room. But yeah, let's put this back. Now, let's show you how it looks in the front. Oh, there's this side. It's more of the tree. Actually, really like this piece here. It actually looks really, really nice. I don't don't know if it's a new piece because I don't get many sets. One of the sets other than Ninjago, some Marvel sets and some Star Wars sets, and that's basically it. But here, I'm looking at the front. We got a really, really nice banner. We got some nice blue uh, roof piece um, texture here. Yeah, again, yeah, the tree looks so far and looks really, really good. Now let's get to the sick. The third floor, like first, it's not first, second, whatever. But we can see the dragon energy core here, the basic one. We got some of the roof here, looks really nice. And here's another part of the tree here with the lantern. Here's another play feature. But first, this bridge looks really nice. We got this balcony here, we got this um, scroll here. And if you do this, so anything that stands on this part of the bridge or balcony you'll fall to your death maybe maybe you can you can survive uh another part of the tree and now you can look at how the entire tree looks it looks really, really nice so let's get into it and nothing too crazy here either like we have the dragon energy core here we got these things here the mini figure can stand here and nothing much space in here and they go to the top we got this bell thing. And that's basically it in the of that. And then we go outside. And boom. And we got also the rooftop. It looks really, really nice. But actually, first when I thought, saw this set, I thought it was, I was just like the temple of the uh, cheat. So I still wanted it. It looks cool. And it doesn't have like, okay, you got a tree. And, so what it's not the craziest thing in the world and then i got this built this up and then i was like what this actually looks really really nice like this every time i saw a video it's kind of cool you know but when i got it in person wow that's like this set looks really really cool good cool. whatever good looking really really good so yeah, this temple looks nice. I also thought it kind of looked like the one from season, also from season five, and um, the temple where and the um, I've always called the sword. You can see, kind of see a little in future. The main one comes number I don't remember all the weapons what they're called. But yeah, actually, the figures that's pretty much it for this video. I really like. Wait, would I recommend this set? Yes, get it while you still can. So yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for this video. So never more so you guys didn't have a beautiful day guys. Goodbye.